Hey guys, Mazo the Boss here once again, back for another sneaker review. Today we are going to do the Hornets 5 um, that just came out this weekend. Um, I think a lot of people slept on it, and I'm going to tell you a couple of reasons why when we do this review. Stay tuned. Uh, first thing you know we do here is look at the box. So I was over to I was able to cop this at um, a local vendor and walk in and get it right away, put it on size in hand and all that great stuff so that always makes me happy um if we take a look at the box you can tell where um the actual box was brought, bought from you can tell where the box was bought and if you look it says foot locker that's ftl this code here means they actually have a code in their system that attaches to this sneaker which is different from what nike uses which is here Waiting for it to clear up. Waiting for it to clear up. So Nike uses the number that's associated with the sneaker here, whereas Foot Locker uses this number. And in saying all those things, um, you can pretty much go on their websites and find these sneakers in that manner. The box has the um, traditional Jordan Air. Jordan Air here on the box. And another Jordan here with the cement box itself and the black bottom. I know you don't think these details mean much, but trust me. And that's why it's always important to get sneakers um, with the box. Uh, you run so many risks when you don't purchase a sneaker with the box, whether it's fake, whether, you know, it's a super um, copy or however they call it. it I, all Anything that didn't come from Nike um, from start to finish, I consider it fake. Um, Super Perfects is a, a group of uh, sneakers, and then you have um, Unauthorized and so on and so forth. So, not to sidetrack and get back on it, let's open this box up and get going. Uh, so, in the box, we have the Charlotte Hornet 5s. Um, as you can see, I've already laced them to my liking, and I've already worn them once because I like them so much. And initially I struggled with this kick because when I saw the first couple of samples, I was not gonna get this kick because I didn't feel that the leather was um, good. It looked kind of cheap, but they upgraded that, thank goodness. And me having the black and white grapes, I had to add this to my collection of grapes. It was just a must cop, as well as um, the fact that a lot of people don't know, like these oh, these grapes were supposed to be the initial release for the grape series, and Nike pulled back on those and went with the white grapes. So, huh, if you're a sneakerhead, you should want this in your collection, and you should have it in your collection. So let's look at the details, starting from the toe box, as we like to do. You have a round toe box here. And you see the little double stitch in there. The laces are purple. There aren't any extra laces in the box. Um, you have the uh, lace lock here. You, of course, by preference, can do with or without. And it depends on what mood I'm in. Sometimes I do lace locks. Sometimes I don't. I like wearing my kick loose. So I don't want to be all tight up. if I'm not playing ball in them. Which I really don't play ball in them. Because um, I used to play ball, but I don't play anymore. So... I like Adidas, to be honest. I like Derrick Rose's Adidas when I do play ball for that extra cushioning in the ankle and support. Um, but if you look closely here, the lace lock is actually the turquoise jump man, which is pretty cool. And then we have um, the tongue. The tongue, I think, is what really caught me because of that silver reflective and then that turquoise jump man. It just really pops out at you. Um, and then, of course, you have the traditional mesh here um, on the tongue and on the side. And then you have the traditional run accents with the turquoise. And, of course, you have the icy soles with the Jumpman and the Jordan logo on the bottom. And on the other side, you have a little white accent here, the air pocket. And that, my friend, will take us to the back where you have the white Jumpman. So, um, pretty simple silhouette, pretty simple layout. Um, I don't know if you don't have them. I don't know. I feel sad for you. I really do. And I really want you to understand that um, you're missing out on an absolute great sneaker. And stay tuned for the walk through, my friends. And see you soon. Thanks for joining. Are you ready for a change? Like Obama, let's do this. Can't bring it for the name.
it. You want it, come and get it. It's nothing to a boss. My goon squad stay with it. Underground play mine, highly explosive. Play the room, short fuse, cause I'm known for explosions. Red and blue, liquid, mixing down to proportion. Cause bitch, I'm the bomb like this. 